Hi, welcome to Art for Tots. Today we'll be working with recyclables to create an amazing sculpture. We'll be inspired by artist Claude Roussel. He created a lot of public sculptures all around New Brunswick. Claude Roussel is Acadian and is considered New Brunswick's first modern artist. One of his best known works is a commemorative statue in Escumina. Before he created the large sculptures, he would make a small maquette. A maquette is a little model to show people what you're planning on making. We have a collection of 21 of his models at the Beaverbrook Art Gallery. They're made out of all kinds of materials. Look at this red, orange, and yellow maquette. You can see the full sculpture on City Hall in St. John. Look at the movement of these triangular flying shapes. You can find this sculpture on the Fredericton Airport. It's called Aerial Forms. For Lord Beaverbrook's 80th birthday, Claude sculpted two beavers. They've been in Officer Square. Claude used wire, plaster, cardboard, wood, glue, and paint to make his models. Our model started with a cardboard base, and then we used toilet paper rolls. So we cut them and stacked them and taped them, and it became kind of a castle, I think. You can create your maquette to be anything you want, and you can use whatever materials you have around the house. Looking through your recycling box is a great way to find things you can reuse. Choose materials that are easy to cut, like thin cardboard or styrofoam, or you could even just use paper. Be very careful when you're using scissors to always cut away from your fingers. You could start with an idea, or you could just see what happens as you cut and tape your shapes together. Use lots of tape to make sure your sculpture holds together. Experiment with different ways of placing them, stacking them, cutting them, and fitting them together. We discovered that toilet paper rolls have all kinds of possibilities. You can slice them, chop them, or open them all the way up. When you have everything assembled and super duper taped together, you can start adding your colors. Sometimes only working with a few colors has a really nice effect. Look at how the yellow, pink, and white work together. Thanks for joining our for Tots. See you next time.